I've completely rethought what I thought pie meant to be in my thinking. Originally it was apple pie, pumpkin pie, pecan pie, and 3.14, but no longer! Now there's a new game in town. A game called Cinnamon. Because what I'm talking about is a completely new way of rethinking pie. That's right. I said a new way to rethink it. The cinnamon pie. Here's all the stuff you're gonna need. One cup of white sugar. One pie crust. One and a half cups of milk or half and half cream. The thicker the better. One and a half tablespoons of all-purpose flour. Two tablespoons of butter or margarine for all us fat loads out there. Am I right? Two whatever the hell these things are. Eggs? What are they called? Yeah, eggs. One teaspoon ground cinnamon. One teaspoon of vanilla extract. See? A pinch of salt. A little bit of cinnamon sugar. A shot glass's worth of rum. And a bowl to mix it all in. Why a cinnamon pie, you ask? Why? Would you ask a snowflake why it's necessary to be cold? Or an iron? Why it smooths out clothing? Or would you ask Odin, Allfather, why it was necessary to destroy the frost giants to maintain peace in the Nine Realms? No. You wouldn't ask why. You would accept it and move on. So let's get started. Like with any pie, you first have to preheat the pie crust. So, we shall first heat the oven up to 400 degrees. Let that preheat. It's true what they say. Cinnamon is the far superior of all the spices. That's including nutmeg, although they do complement each other very well. Much like scotch in a little bit of water, or scotch in most things in life. Well, now the oven has been preheated to 400 degrees, so we just pop the pie in for 10 minutes. 10 minutes. It's been 10 minutes. Pie crust is nice and preheated. So now it's time to mix the ingredients. Ingredients. First things first. We have to beat the eggs. So we start with one. And two. Oh, very nice. And we take a fork and we stir it up nice. Look at it right there. We want to make sure there's no clumps. That right there. That's good. Now, we melt the butter. Yay! Okay, now I've mixed in all the ingredients necessary except for the milk. That comes later. Oh, forgot the cinnamon sugar. Get a couple things of there and there. Not too much. Now comes the fun part. We mix it! Ha-ha! Okay, stage one is complete. See, you got the, uh, you have a sort of, not, not, not necessarily dough, but it's, it's not too loose, not too, but not too thick either. It's perfect. It's about, it's about time to add the milk. So, you pour the half and half milk in there. All right, get it all in there. And then, you mix again. Nice, creamy consistency there. You know, makes the ripples. You could, you could drink that if it wasn't for fear of diabetes, which you would, un you would undoubtedly get. But, 
It is still pretty tasty. Now it's time to actually bake it. Okay, next step, pour all the ingredients into the pie. Like so. Careful, careful. Get in there. See, see, this is why you want a deep dish crust so you can, you know, get as much in there as possible. It's tasty tasty, isn't it? Balance. Balance. Eye of the tiger, heart of the lotus. I have 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 the yes. Now we cook for 15 minutes at 400 degrees and 45 minutes at 355 degrees. Baking is fun. Time's up, and the pie is done. As you can see, it's still bubbling a little bit, but that's to be expected, you know, it's, it's cooling off. You know the whole windowsill thing? It's, per it's, it's pretty important. You gotta get this thing to where it's not too hot, and not too cold. Just right. So we're gonna set this down here, And we're just going to let it cool for a little while. While we wait for the pie to cool, let's think of all the interesting things that we could do with our time. Like reading a book. Reading a book on the internet. Writing a Facebook status about reading a book on the internet. Or just a good old-fashioned knife game! And there you have it. This, this is the lovely completed cinnamon pie right here. As you can see it's, it's nice and golden, golden brown. It's got, it's, it's really juicy. It's really, really juicy as you can see in this, this general area right here. Of course you want that. You want that. The cinnamon pie is in fact a custard pie. So, you have the nice goodness. I cut a little slice here, which, which, I, which I have over here. This is the, this is the good slice of, of cinnamon pie here. Just, uh, you got the nice triangular shape, all the cinnamonness. You can even still smell the rum. But it's, it's actually, it's, it's still a little loose, but it's really nice. Let's, let's go ahead and eat it. So that's it. That's how you make a cinnamon pie. It's delicious. I'll even... Mm. Right here's good. I should really call the should really call the hospital. I see people on the internet doing those cinnamon challenges and I just think to myself, what a waste.